This is to go over some grammar vocabulary. We're going to be talking about main verb. Every English sentence has a main verb. Sometimes there is an auxiliary verb or helping verb. So if I say, I speak Chinese, this is the main verb, speak. I can speak Chinese. Here's an auxiliary verb, can, and here is the main verb. I don't speak Japanese. Here is auxiliary and main verb. Do you like coffee? Auxiliary and main verb. Okay, the present continuous always has an auxiliary verb. I am explaining verbs. Here's auxiliary M. The past continuous does too. The students were waiting. Here is auxiliary verb were. The main verb is wait. Okay, um, B and M is, are, and was, and were. These can all be main verb in some sentences and an auxiliary in others. So when I say I am a student, okay, this is the only verb in the sentence and it's the main verb. But when I say, I am learning English, am is the auxiliary verb, and learn is the main verb. The present continuous uses the auxiliary am or is or are, and the past continuous uses the auxiliary was or were, and then the main verb with ing. The simple present is just the main verb, but it uses auxiliary do and does for questions and negatives. The simple past is just the past verb, but it uses the auxiliary did for questions and negatives. Do not use auxiliary am, is, or are with the simple present. This is a mistake that students often make. When I put two stars, that means it's wrong. I am study English. We never say that. Or he was win. Or he was, I was go. We never say that. We are students is possible. We are study English is impossible. Okay. This is, we this is whether the sentence is possible in English or is it impossible in the English language. We are studying English is possible. We study English is possible. I was go is impossible. We never, never say that. If you think you hear it, probably the person said, I was going, I-N-G, and you can't hear the I-N-G. But a native speaker will never say, I was go. I do go is also impossible. The do is for the negative. You can say, I don't go. Or... The do can be for the question. Do you go to school? Is possible. He went is possible. He did win is impossible. He didn't go is possible. You can see the did has the past tense. Then the main verb goes to the base form. You have the auxiliary in the past tense for the simple past. Then the main verb is the base form. He didn't win. That's impossible. We never say that. Did he go? That's possible. Did he win? Is impossible. We never say it. Okay, for the present perfect, we use the auxiliary have or has. And have and has can also be a main verb in some sentences. Okay, I have a headache. Have here is the main verb. It's the only verb in the sentence, and it's the main verb. Do you have a headache? Here's a simple present question. Here's the main verb. Here is an auxiliary. How long have you been in the U.S.? Been is the main verb. It's the past participle of be. And in this sentence, have is an auxiliary. So here's the auxiliary verb. Here is the main verb. Okay, every verb has three parts. 
the main verb, the past form, or the past participle. The regular verbs are easy. They just add ed. Walk, walked, walked. Work, worked, worked. Study, studied, studied. Wash, washed, washed. Cook, cooked, cooked. But many commonly used verbs are irregular. That means different from regular. And here are some common irregular verbs. Sit, sat, sat. Drink, drank, drunk. Eat, ate, eaten. Drive, drove, driven.